Hi, how y'all doing? It's Wednesday. What's the date today? The 13th? I can't remember. The 14th, right? Was it the 14th today? Yep, today's the 14th of June 2023. So, the Schumann, I noticed, I just looked at it, a 7-hour blackout with a high of 24. So, something's happening. I think the CMEs on the sun solar flares are coming off. Because there's a lot of them up there, right? So, possibly. It rained here a little bit this afternoon around 4 o'clock. Other than that, it's windy, cloudy. I've seen some blue, right? I've seen a red-winged blackbird. Right? When I was leaving uh, the town next to me, flew past the truck. I had to give a drive. I made 20 bucks, right? Took Buddy's friend down to a dentist in, Gray in the next town over. And uh, he had an emergency visit. He had a great big hunk of calcium stuck to the side of his tooth. He thought it was a bad tooth or an abscess, right? It just happened to be this hunk of calcium. Like, as big as your fingernail. Right? Well, about an eighth of an inch, inch thick. I said, how'd they get it off? He said, they, uh, uh, not drilled, but, you know, zzz, grinded it off, right? And I was like, wow. So, that was different, right? Took him an hour and a half down there. So, of course, the guy that owns the truck had to come with me, right? Because uh, it was his friend. And, uh, tried to talk me into going to, into the hotel down there to have a beer. I was like, no. I said, you can. I said, you can have one, right? If you're not, but if you're not out in an hour, I'll leave you here. You know, I don't really care what happens anymore, right? So, yeah, I won't be. Uh, what do you call? Used by anybody, let's say. You know, right? So, and then I took him. We sat in front in the park, overlooking the the lake waiting for his buddy to call from the dentist. And I noticed that it was just some men's, old men, like, well, my age, maybe a little bit older, sitting in the park. And I don't know if they were homeless, but they all seemed like have really dark energy. Do you know what I mean? It was strange. One guy pulled up in a car, got out, and asked, my, asked the guy for if he would sell him a cigarette. Right? So he just gave him one. He said, no, I don't want your change, right? He says... I said, I would have took the change. He says, yeah, but he's off. He's hard up on his luck, he said. I said, yeah, true. I was just joking with him, you know, trying to lighten the mood. So, yeah, I don't enjoy hanging around with people that are drinking when I'm sober. And the last time I went to the chiropractor, I told him about the last time I drank. I had one drink and kept on falling asleep. And he said, it's probably my liver saying that's enough alcohol, you know. It doesn't want to have it anymore. Plus all the sun codes and the DNA coming down, you know, repairing and stuff like that. So it's not a bad thing at all because alcohol isn't good for us. Not at all. Right? Yeah. I hope you're not believing anything that's happening in the news. Right? It's just to wake up the sheeple. It is. Other than that, yeah. Just be careful because the bad guys are still on the loose having little temper tantrums because they have to leave. So it's all about being a little narcissist, a three-year-old having a temper tantrum, smashing things before because they, you know, they have to do something and they don't want to do it. Or taking a fit and screaming and yelling, right? Yeah. I was watching a tarot card reader. She's got the same information as me. What was her name? Lori? Lori something. Darn it, I should have wrote the last name down. You want, might want to check her out. She's pretty straightforward. And, yeah, she's, I guess you call a patriot tarot reader, you know? And she had mentioned that another reason for those wildfires, think of it as a smoke screen. She asked the cards, and it came out that, yes, they were done by the bad guys. And it was to cover, as well, People are saying it's for to move us into the 15-minute cities and to, um, what else, uh, the climate uh, hoax, you know, kind of thing, right? To bring up their 
their numbers or whatever to try to force people to believe in climate change. And she said actually what it was is they were trying to uh, cover themselves up so they could move some little ones, you know, human trafficking, right? That's what it was. Because I thought it was strange. It was just in places and not directly where the wind should have been taking it, you know, and in the United States. So, yeah, I guess the good guys uh, stopped them. This is what the cards, the tarot cards said. So I resonate with them. So I believe it. You know, I do. So it's a good thing. Right? We are in the middle of a, a WAR, right? So, yeah. And it's psychological, you know, subterfuge, all that stuff, right? So, makes sense, doesn't it? She also said the good guys were uh, counteracting the chemicals that were in the smoke that they were pumping in down in the States, right? So it's not going to cause harm or anything to the people or to nature and critters and creatures, kind of thing like that. So, we'll see. We shall see, won't we? You know? It's nice to know people that live in these areas where you can contact them and ask them if they really see what's going on, if it's really happening, right? I lost a childhood friend the other day. I noticed on Facebook her husband uh, posted that she had passed. Same age as me. We are in the same grade. She lived in New Zealand, though. I haven't seen her since I was like, oh, goodness, 26, 27, something like that, right? Maybe even 25. But yeah, she was like four times, four times vaxxed, you know. And she died of, suddenly died. Do you know what I mean, kind of thing? So, yeah, I don't know if the sheep will get it or not. You know, died suddenly, that's what it was, right? I don't know if they get it or not, or if they can see the uh, synchronicity be between it. Or if they think it's just a quink and ink, right? Yeah. And I heard two ambulances today. I wonder how many ambulances you all hear in, in your neighborhoods every day, right? Like, this is what's going down. It's the sun codes and the DNA and all that. This is the change. The vibration rays, and they can't handle it, right? Unless they've done their shadow work, and... Well, I don't know, right? But it seems like they're the ones that are popping off. I gotta go and do a, uh, internment. Put my mother into the ground on Friday. It's her birthday, right? My sisters are gonna be there. One I get along with, the young one, and then the other young one. Well, she's just a little bit, a year at 18 months, I guess, younger than me. She's going to be there, so I'm not looking forward to that because she tried to hurt me, right? After my mother died, she threw a bag of coins at me, and she was really, I should hit you, she says, right? I was like, go ahead. I'm too old to fight, I'll just call the cops, have her charged, right? Call the Nazi cops, right? They want to make money. So they're all just a bunch of thieves anyway. If they, if they know who they're working for, they know what they're doing. So, yeah. Pretty quiet out again today though. It was. Not very many people out at all. Not very many birds. Well, I've seen a lot of Robins and that red or red winged blackbird, but and a few seagulls. It's not natural. I wonder where they all are. I usually see a lot more than that, right? Just flying around in the air. I did think I seen a raven too. It should be uh, watch for these signs because they're messages, right? They are signs. Everything in nature, you've got to become aware of it. Pay attention. What crosses your path or what you see? right it's a message and then look it up like red i looked it up red wood red winged blackbird right the spiritual meaning or animals speak right and red 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 winged blackbird after that and it was a good message it came up to what i am right you know i'm balanced i am the warrior i am right on track i am I am abundance of so many things, not in the way the sheep would think of abundance, right? But spiritually abundant. And 
I don't really have to go without anything I need. It's always, pro I always have enough. So I am grateful for that. I really am living such a poor life, right? I still, I'm okay, you know? I am. See how dark my eyes are? I woke up this morning looking like I had black eyes. I don't know what that's about. Maybe it's my health, right? I do have some strange pains in my back. So, I don't know. We'll see what I look like tomorrow, right? See how I feel tomorrow. Yeah. Doctors can't do anything for me anyway, right? That's what they told me when they give me the fibromyalgia. Medical system can never do anything for you. So, I guess I'll just grin and bear it like I have been doing for 20 years, you know? What else do you do, right? Unless I can find me a, a healing shaman. I'm a shaman, a Hyoka shaman. I just haven't been able to heal myself yet. But I'm still trying. I will never surrender. Right? Until the day I transition. 